Hi, welcome to the video where I just talk over uh, my drawing and talk about my drawing process unscripted. I don't have time for scripts. Anyways, so, um, this one is, okay, I don't like it. Um, I gave up on a lot of things. My main goal for this, though, was to make it better, make it look better, because the original one- Oh, this is a redraw. Okay. Redraw Himiko from Star Rail, or that's where I know her from, if you say she's from Hawkeye or whatever, I don't care. But anyways, so, um, you can see that I drew a whole sketch or whatever, um, and then I started lining it and I realized it sucks because I needed a reference for the hand that's like tucking her hair behind her back. Um, and then I got the reference and it, it just doesn't look right and it wouldn't be way better with how the sketch is <laughs> right now. So, uh, yeah, that's why I restarted it, which I... Honestly, I wanted to spend, like, less time on this, so I, I don't know, I just, I really want to make finished pieces instead of, like, starting them and then throwing them away because they're not perfect. Like, I don't, I don't care anymore, I just, I just need something um, to, like, go back on and view my progress or whatever, so that's what I did here. And you can probably see, like, by the end of the video, <laughs> I decided to change some things a bit because I wasn't drawing all day. Um, especially, like, her weapon or whatever, I was not trying to do that. Which, um, if I was... Honestly, I probably shouldn't have done that, but I just wanted to be done with it. <laughs> like, I just wanted to finish it one day. When I redraw it again, it'll, uh, maybe it'll come back, who knows, but for now, we're leaving it, we're leaving it alone, okay? What else? Anyway, I just wanted to talk about references, because holy moly, do they actually help? Like, I started this, and I was like, I don't know, well, okay, I thought I knew what I was doing, but then I started lining it and realized, damn, it looks like crap. So I guess I didn't know what I was doing. Um, newsflash references will always and forever help for everything, any, anytime, anywhere. Um, also her freaking costume is ridiculous. I'm not, I don't want to draw all of that. You can, like, I just, her dress doesn't look like that. Um, but I don't want to do, I don't want to try to figure out what the hell is going on with her top of the dress. <laughs> like all the references I was looking at. I was looking at like official art. It uh it's a little confusing, but I guess I should have looked at the models and stuff because I missed her earring too, because uh, she doesn't have it in the official art, so what what the heck? Man, the line quality is so sketchy, like I think I did really good on the fold so I'm not gonna lie kind of popped off with that one. I forgot everything that I wanted to talk about. This is why you need to take notes and write a script. <laughs> Don't be like me. Oh my god, this hand too. I just- I hate- I like hands. I just hate when they don't work. Anyways, uh, like, it's terrible whenever you have just one piece that you've been working on for hours. Well, this one didn't take me that long, actually. I- I- I can't- I don't know how long it took me, but honestly, I should have been jumping <laughs> to something else because I got so lazy towards the end and you can see it when I color and like do the background, I'm just like, okay, I just want this to be done. Oh, there's me trying to attempt the fucking weapon. <laughs> it's so bad, I wasn't- <laughs> got demolished, it's erased from existence. It was terrible. I don't like it. Anyways, that hand turned out really cool though. I might have, I might have slayed with that one. Um, 
I couldn't figure out how to line it though, so I just <laughs> brought it up in the sketch layer. <laughs> oh my god, this is what happens when you when you draw for hours on end. Taking a break is actually so important. Don't don't not take a break. I I shouldn't have done this in one sitting, but I just really wanted to crap this out. Don't do that. <laughs> Take your time and like make something that you're gonna be a li at least a little proud of. And it's not like I'm I'm a little proud of this I guess because I will say I used reference quite good. So props to me. But uh yeah, and you can see when I color it I'm just like but it's so much easier like this. I might do all of my pieces like this from now on. Personal pieces. Because, oh my god, I just slapped a base color on there. And put the top colors on it. And like, boom. I turned out amazing. I hate eyes. I don't... <laughs> I don't like the eyes. Um, I never had the anime phase. Or I did have an anime phase, I never had the anime eyeball phase where like, you make the eyes as detailed as you can, like Oshinoko or something. But uh, no, that's, that's not me. You get two little circles for that. Iris? P pupil. I don't fucking know. <laughs> well, but yeah, so I did the beige colors and then... I worked on the background. I wanted to do like a little something else. I'm just gonna leave it like how I did in the original. But um, the ring lighting. <laughs> oh, ring lighting, rim lighting or whatever. I don't know. I didn't want to do a lot because um, I'm trying to go for more like a simple coloring style because I'm absolutely atrocious at coloring, which I will probably be doing a lot more studies on <laughs> and then your future um but yeah i didn't want to do too much um i already spent too much time on it anyway so it's supposed to be like a little haha uh, look how far look how i don't i don't know man i just i just read you here we go that's all i did i accomplished what i set out to do and that background looks way better than how it turned out right now I will say because <laughs> I just started messing with shit because I, I got bored oh yeah the freaking uh dreamy line work or whatever here's here's how you do it I'll give you a tutorial you take the baseline art and then duplicate it set it to multiply blur it and like you know mess with it however you want and you take the blurred and duplicate it, set it to overlay, put like a purplish color or something. I don't know. That's what I did. A little tutorial for you. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Um, like and subscribe if you want more. Let me know what you want to see. Thanks. Bye.